Hey guys, Bubble Pop Kids here, Squishy Chopping Time, times seven. Seven squishy things up on my chopping block. Come on everybody, let's do this. Wait, do we have a choice? Do we have a choice? I don't think so. What do you have here? Fake stress sausage, like squishy sausage? Weird, weird. Looks like Halloween must have dropped by, I see two balloons. These are like homemade. Little one, super gigantic one, and what is this? Gudetama egg, love you Bubble. Got some homemade squishies. Colleen dropped these off and yesterday she made like the biggest one I've ever seen. I got kind of a medium size, super tiny one, and I got two of these little capsules. Look at these little squishy things inside. I've never seen them before. So excited to chop them up. Here's your final squishy thing we got. We're not gonna be chopping it up, but we're gonna be squishing it. We got some barrel of slime. I love this. This is like the classic crazy slime in a purple color. Yeah. So like get the facts straight, you have like one, two, three, four, five, six squishies to chop and just a squishy thing. Get the facts straight. And also get it right that this super huge sausage is not food. It's not food bubble. It's just like a stress squishy. Get it right. Out of my little bubble teenies, we had our intro. We took a look at everything. I got my nails done, my little new Christmas shivies. And if you guys are going to do this at home, just make sure you have an adult or parent watching. Don't know what's in these little babies. Don't know how sharp these are. Super sharp scissors. What do you guys say we do some squishy chopping? And Bubble, if I do say, your nails are like beautiful today. It looks like you were going to a wedding, not about to do some squishy chopping. They are beautiful. Love you. Woo, and here we go. So many good ones to chop today. I think I'm most excited about the sausage. Although, right here we have a huge homemade, or pretty much a medium size, Colleen Squishy. You never know what's going to be inside of her homemades. Ooh, it feels weird. <laughs> There's definitely something in the center. Feels like a mango pit. <sighs> Maybe it feels like a mango pit, but like definitely she did not put a mango pit in here. And if she did, I'm not talking to her anymore. How about that? This feels kind of like jello or like jelly bath or slime bath. Something super slimy is in here, but I can't put my finger on it. And your nails are just too beautiful to squish today. Like seriously. Yeah. Squish it around. I do feel something in the middle. Some kind of plastic. I just have no clue what's in here. So what do you guys see? We do our little explosion method. Get my pretty shizzies and chop it. Oh. Bubbles, this looks like nuclear. Is this like nuclear waste? It's like super glittery, super pretty, but I don't know. Ooh, what is this? It's like some glittery putty. Ooh, what did she make this? It's like the cutest putty I've ever seen. It's got crystals and glitter. What is that? Squeeze it out. Chop it up a little more. I can't get it out of there. Ooh, looks like treasure. <laughs> Look at this thing. Ew. Seriously, it looks like treasure with like a walnut or an acorn in the middle. Like what is up with that? And then we have all of this beautiful silver with some pink, stretchy, gooey thing. Like tarantula spider. Ha! Huh. And you better call Colleen right away and tell her this homemade was like magnificent from start to end. Look at this thing. Super cute like blind bag walnut. We get a stretchy spider, my favorite color pink, and this awesome, most shiny, shiny putty. Like, come on. Woo! Colleen is not just like a squishy maker anymore. I think she's a slime and putty maker. She definitely must have made this. Unless she bought it. I don't know. It's like a super huge chunk. It's bigger than my hand. Look at this glittery, squishy gold. Goodness. Uh, like, that's not how you squish a squishy slime. You have to like make it super satisfying and super, super relaxing. Like this. Like that. Look at the sparkle hit the light. It's like... It's like galaxy. Can't believe it. I don't know where she got this stuff, but like, I need a whole gallon of it. This is like a glittery Christmas log. Like seriously, the best thing on the planet. But like, what about this? What do you make about this pink tarantula? Like, why did she put it in there? And why did she put like a little woodsies? Why? I guess Colleen is feeling a little bit happy in the beginning of the year. She's not making anything gross with spiders and bugs. She's making super pretty ones. Love this. We got this stretchy little spider. Ooh, looks like jello. Look at that. Squish it. Ah. And seriously, not only did we get the spider, 
spider, like why are you only paying attention to them? We get a little woodsies, bobblehead collection. This is the most adorable walnut or acorn ever. To open it, maybe it's like a squishy. Maybe it's like a little squirrel or chipmunk squishy. How about that? Ah, your sizzies. So cute, like purple and brown, like the cutest colors ever. What's gonna be in here? What is gonna be in here? Like, are you serious? Like, this is like a puppy, like a Valentine puppy, strawberry on the shirt. It's not a squishy. Oh, look at this little thing, this little woodsy. Oh, it's so adorable. For some reason, I thought it was going to be a squishy, but it is a little bobblehead puppy. Look at that. It's got a little bow, a little strawberry outfit. Oh, this is just, like, too adorable. <laughs> Watch me, Bubble, from Woodsy Land. Watching you. Super weird, like its head is not connected normally. Like, oh, look at that. It's spinning around and bobbing. Oh, can't stand it. What do we have here? Stickers. Is it stickers? Besides our little puppy dog, how cute she's sitting in the glitter. We get this little collector's guide. There's so many of these little woodsies to collect. Oh, gotta get more of them. They're so super adorbs. And I'm looking at every single one here. I think this was probably the cutest. Cute, but like bubble, I'm more of a cat person, so like I just can't stand it. I like cats, not these ugly little puppies. Cover it in the glitter putty. Cover it. Ugh. You're lucky I'd like you, otherwise I would seriously like chop this thing up like a squishy. But I'm not gonna. It's gonna be nice today. One of the surprises was not squishy and shoppable, but this little spidey definitely is. Ooh, look at this thing. It looks like jello. It almost looks like a little gummy spider. Definitely isn't. It's made of some squishy, sticky, slimy rubber. Chop it. Chop its little tarantula butt. Pop. Ah. Ew, that looks like juice in there. Like super juicy. Like one of those little gusher fruit snacks. That's what that seriously looks like. Like this is a spider butt that holds all the poison. I'm gonna chop it up. Ah, so nice. Feels like a window cling or like jello jigglers. For real. Ah, so much fun. I'm gonna just chop every little tarantula leg off. So good. Look at that. Look at that. That's like squishy. That's like squishy choppy. Feel like I got a handful of jello jigglers. That's exactly what it feels like. Ah, oh, it smells so bad. It smells like super glue. It's so sticky and slimy. Love that little spider. Move it along, Bob, because like we're totally over this. We're totally over this. Seriously over this super shiny, glittery, like unbelievable putty. And definitely over this that pops out of an acorn. Like I can't take it anymore. Move along. But before we move along, I think I'm going to get a little of this stuff. Like roll it into a ball and put it in here. I think that's super cute. It looks like lip gloss or something. Doesn't it? Doesn't it look like an acorn lip gloss? <sighs> Just the best idea. Ha! From homey to stress sausage. Ooh, look at this thing. It's like a big old hot dog. I don't know. It's just super big, super heavy. Squeeze me. Not food. We like already went over that it's not food. It is not food. You cannot eat this. You can squeeze it and chop it. That's about it. So like, get to it. Are you joking? Are you joking? This is like a squishy corn dog. Not a sausage. Not a sausage. What is this? <laughs> what is on my chopping block right now? I couldn't see it too good through the plastic. This looks like a squishy, wishy little corn dog. Oh, it feels so, so weird. To tell you the truth, it kind of feels like kinetic sand. It feels like some kind of sand. Look, it's got those little silver things, just like the real sausage. It kind of looks like a baked potato. I don't know. Ooh, it's stretchy. So rude. Like, you know I cannot stand corn dogs, and you're gonna go and get a corn dog squishy for the show, okay? And like, not only is it a dirty, yucky corn dog, it's like completely raw. It's raw dough. Like, what is wrong with you? At first I thought it was kawaii, but it's like not kawaii. It's like super ugly. That's what it is. Can you just chop it already? Can you chop it? Oh. Here goes. This is definitely one of the weirder ones I've had. Looks like a chicken sausage. Slicey. Oh. Ew, that's like sausage ganache. Like, are you kidding? Look at this stuff. Look at this stuff. This is like corn dog cottage cheese. Ooh, this stuff is so weird. This is like the first time I've ever seen the squishy ingredient. And I am not liking it. Ooh, it's like a wet, sticky, kinetic sand. It feels like sand, and it feels a little bit like mashed potato. 
what's going on where did they get this this thing has like a pound Ew. sandy mashed potato Sandy mashed potato. That is the inner ingredient of like every corn dog in the world. That's why I don't like it, Bubble. That's why I don't like it. So look what we're gonna do. We're gonna fillet this nasty little corn dog and take out all the sand mashed potato so you can see how seriously gross these things are because these things are like evil. So much of it in here. Oh, I cannot take the texture. It's not squishy. It just feels like I reached into a bowl of sand, mixed it with some potatoes or some kind of like butter. Oh, I don't like it. Oh, it smells so bad. It smells like paint. Eww, it's filled, it's filled. It's just nasty. <laughs> I don't like it. I actually kind of like it. I actually kind of like it. Like, I like the sandy mashed potato more than I like the corn dog exterior. Like, that is so gross. Probably like honey flavor, but there's tons of this stuff, and this is like squishy goodness. Really is. It's totally making a mess on your chopping block, but like, for stress relief, it is perfect. It is perfect. Look at that. Look at that. Sandy mashed potatoes rock. <laughs> I just do not know what to say. When I was squishing this around, I this is like the least thing I thought was in here. I don't even know what this is. I've never seen it. I thought I saw it all with the squishies. Definitely not. Give us a little chop. So basically, I like the nice rubber on the outside. But me no likey this. Get it away. Got a better idea, Bob, instead of like getting it away. I'm gonna like put all of the sandy mashed potato in here and like roll it up like a little enchilada or burrito, and I'm having it for lunch tomorrow. Ugh, <laughs> I did not want to do any cleaning today. I ended up for like 10 minutes cleaning all that sticky, sandy stuff. I don't even know what that was. I don't know who made that thing. I cleaned off my shishies, and we got another Colleen who made. Ooh, ooh, it's like green. Color change. Oh, that is not color change. This is not color change. This is like squeezing a balloon and looking at the inside. Oh. It's almost like Colleen went and like took it upon herself to make like a mesh stress ball, but it didn't really come out like that. It came out like super weird looking. I'm not impressed with that. And actually, we're just gonna chop it. I'm not gonna wait for you to talk. Explosion method. Wah! Ew. The first one was glittery and pretty. What is the thing? It's some like ooze. It was pink. I thought whatever came out of here was gonna be pink. Ooh, it's like a big old snot. Correct. It is a big old snot with big old snotty caterpillars. Look at these caterpillars, Bob. They are super evil. They have horns and pinchers. Oh, how did you get those in there? Look, we got a blue one. This is like devil caterpillar. <laughs> Still not too bad. I don't like it as much as the last one, but I kind of like it. It's got this jiggly green stuff. We got little baby caterpillars. Ooh, this one is so sweet. These two look kind of weird. They got horns and thorns ready to bite me. Ooh, we got another one. Weirdo. Colleen is like literally a superhero. Like she can make a squishy like no one else. You can never make a homemade like this. Look at this green stuff. Where did she get it? Like where did she find these caterpillars? She is like, she is like an artist. <laughs> Crazy little mess here. Ooh, it looks like someone threw up, but I'm kind of loving it. I like this little pink balloon it was in. I love this stuff. But I love these little caterpillars more. Ooh, look at this purple. We got four. Turn them into butterflies. This is actually not ooze or slime. This is like caterpillar food. They're gonna sit and eat all their little baby caterpillar food, and they're gonna turn into beautiful butterflies, like in this video. Yeah, right. Now that I'm looking at these things, I can't stand them because they're not squishies. They're not squishies. They're just like hard plastic. Like, what are we gonna do with it? Looks like a beetle. Seriously, looks like a beetle. This is horrible. Can't chop through plastic. Might as well chop through the slime. Or like the caterpillar food. That's pretty choppable. Look at it. You can cut it. It's amazing. And Bubble, don't even like try to touch this green one. It's gonna give you warts on your fingers. Like, seriously. That is a wart caterpillar. Oh, how lovely. You brought Gumball Machine prizes to the Squishy Show. Congrats. Ooh. <laughs> 
those crazy little caterpillars. I have all that slime stuck up in my fingernails. Moving along to these cute little capsules. Now these things are like the most amazing little surprise 25 cents toys. I found these at like my local Target. And you gotta see what they are. Look at it. I think it looks like a dragon. Let me check out this one. Like, what is this? This is like the weirdest kind of squishy stuff. This thing looks like a tangerine. But this one, definitely dragon. Love it. When I first saw these little ballies in the machine, I thought these were either candies or gumballs. But then when I got one, I actually opened one already. It was white. They are little squishy faces. They got these little squishy faces. Almost looks like a Christmas ornament. That's what it reminds me of. Look at this. Yeah, squishy squish. Oh, look at this. There's like a whole entire creepy family of these little things. You got like the blue and orange, but the other ones, they are super weird. I only like these two. Like, seriously, these are the best. The best. This is like a little baby Clementine. Love it. Look at these little squishy babies. <laughs> I wish I could tell you how teeny tiny they are. They're almost the size of my fingernail. Super tiny, they're like little bubbles with these stems. What is that little thing? You don't know? These things are like little cherry bombs and that's like the igniter. That is like the little igniter on the top to blow them up. <sighs> Gotta teach you everything. You know what these little things also remind me of? They look like those little figs, like those little figs, their little prunes. I don't know, I don't even want to chop them, they're so cute. Ooh, they look like they got buggy beads. Or sprinkles. Buggy beads are sprinkles, like let's get it over with and prove you wrong. Let's prove you wrong, Bubble. Look at this. These are not buggy beads, they're like little dragon eggs. They're little baby dragon eggs and they're super sticky and they're like ready to hatch. Like look at this thing. This is like the dragon fig. See what he does. Ugh, he's got like a super huge load of those things. Maybe they're like birthday cake sprinkles. I don't get it. Popped open our little cutie squishies. These are the smallest, probably the tiniest ones I've ever seen. And they had about a million billion little bugget beads, those little styrofoam beads. The outer piece of this is like almost like a slime. Ugh. It's like a little donut. With my gut instinct, and I'm thinking these things are like super disgusting. Like, what were they, 25 cents or like 50 cents? Because that's like all they're worth. That is all they're worth. I don't like the insides, I don't like the outsides, I don't even like the shape of them. They're disgusting. Like, stick them back in their little capsule and put them back in whatever gumball machine you like got them from because they are totally useless. Ugh. From these two little wackos all chopped up, we got some slime in. Ooh, look at this barrel of slime. I've had these before, but I don't think I've had this purple color. Take a look, ooh, that is the good stuff. You are wrong about that. This is like the double good stuff. This is like the squishy stuff I live for. The squishy stuff I eat for breakfast every morning. Like, look at it. It's pink and purple and beautiful and gushy and slimy. Yeah, look at the jiggle on it. This is like premium slime right here from a barrel. Look at the jiggle. Squishing it around so much, I turned it into like grape jelly or grape jam. I got it all choppy looking and all you have to do with this stuff is play with it a little more and it's gonna be smooth and slimy. Like, calm down Bubble, you better not be turning my barrel of slime, slime into no grape jelly. We're gonna keep it nice and smooth, we're not like making it all cottage cheesy. What is wrong with you? you destroyed it. You don't know how to play with squishies anymore. Seriously, you don't. Starting with that sausage that you like ripped up with all the sand in it. Ugh, put it away. I'm over it. Pack up my barrel of slime so we can get to the final squishy treat. I was never going to speak to you again because you messed up my slime, but like you redeemed yourself, Bubble, because you have a Gudetama. Like a Gudetama right in front of my eyes. Love you again. Oh no! Final squish up on my chopping block. We got the Gudetama. Yes. <laughs> I've had a couple of these before, but this one is a little weird. It is a black egg. Ooh. Looks a little bit rotten. 
No, no, you got it totally wrong like you always do. This is like not a rotten egg. A black egg is like a delicacy around the world. But you don't know stuff like that bubble because you don't travel like I do. Look at this thing. Look at this thing. This is like black egg goodness right here with glutatana filling. That's what it is. Looks like an ostrich egg. It's like leaking. Oh, but I popped it. This little glutatana here, but I didn't. I think it just had a little water on the outside. I definitely didn't. Gotta give it a couple little squishes before we chop this black egg it up. Ooh. Like, where are you, Gudetana? There you are. Where are you, Gudetana? There you are. I love you. You little yellow eggy. Love you. You think this is like a splat ball. Like, how amazing is that? It's like a little splat ball with this little yellow egg yolk inside. That is like squishy genius. Like, for real. How are we gonna pop this thing? Don't wanna hurt our little Yoki. Yeah. No. Going with the explosion. How about that, Bob? For a grand finale. Yeah. I got eggy juice on the table. Ooh, look at this. It all squirted out of there. Find our little prize. Ooh. Love this little yellow guy. Actually, he's not yellow. This one is kind of brown. This guy is like the golden Gudetana. And like, if you cut one of these, you're gonna have bad luck for like a hundred years. But like, what else? I'm so ready to chop him. He looks like, he looks like rotten. Ooh. He looks like a hula dancer, like completely chopped in half. So let's just finish it up. Super hard to chop. This is like rubber. This is like rubber from the moon or something. This is not earth rubber. Super hard. Ugh. Our little Gudetani baby is chopped up. Ooh, that was almost like a bouncy ball kind of rubber. Such a weird color. Ooh, I love this. I love these things. These water ball shells, whatever. Love them. Slice it. Best sound on the planet, like slicing an empty water ball, like the best sound on the planet. Just listen. Don't you love it? Let's package up this thing and like send it back and get a new one to chop. Let's do that. <laughs> Mountain of greatness until you like threw in the sandy corn dog. Never talking to you. Bubble teenies, the squishy chopping has come to an end for the day. Oh, I love this video. I think my absolute favorite squishy we chopped up was the first homemade. I love this silver glittery stuff. I love this little puppy and the acorn. I just thought it was the cutest. I even like that little spider. I like this one with all the boogers. The sausage, I don't know. It was like a mashed potato with sand. It looked like a corn dog. Oh, can't figure it out. I pretty much loved everything except your nasty, like, sand corn dog and these little things with buggy pellets. They were super tiny and gross. I think my theme was, like, honestly, that tarantula. I love that thing. There you go. I love this. And we are going to have so many more fun videos coming up on the show. And if you want to subscribe to our channel, just click this big yellow bubble with the bubblegum machine and subscribe. Have a great day, you guys. Bye.